Good morning everyone. This is Dr. Umaima Ghazal and today in this video we will talk about the term cosmetic and we can say like how we will define cosmetics. Cosmetic products are generally defined as uh, articles intended to be applied to the human body by being rubbed, poured, sprinkled or sprayed for cleansing, promoting attractiveness, beautifying or altering the appearance. So in all these ways, we are using a variety of cosmetic products. And now the question came, what is the need of cosmetics? Cosmetic we are needing beyond physical health. Cosmetic can help to improve our mood, enhance our appearance and boost our self-esteem as well. So in this way, they can also help to exhibit personal style. As such, they are an important means of social expression as well. What is the meaning of the word cosmetic? Basically, cosmetic comes from a Greek language which means to adorn or addition of something decorative to a person or a thing. And it can also be defined as a substance which comes in contact with various parts of the human body like skin, hair, nail, lips, teeth and mucous membrane. Cosmetic substances help in improving or changing the outward show of the body and also mask the order of the body and it also helps to protect skin and keep it in a good condition. Whatever the effects and the working procedures of a cosmetic which are totally purely related to the outer surface of the skin. Cosmetics are not related in any manner to the internal surface of the skin or any internal part of your body. In general, when we are talking about cosmetics, cosmetics are external preparations which are applied on external parts of the body. Sometimes cosmetic products are uh, prepared with the help or the, with a combination of different kind of a chemical compounds. And sometimes when we are talking about cosmetics and we are seeing in a market also variety of cosmetic products where that natural ingredients are adding in that and some of the cosmetic products which are in a range of organic cosmetic products. Nowadays, cosmetics are considered as an essential component in life. Why they not only attract the people towards it, but also impart psychological effects. Psychological effects in that manner, a person, if, uh, if that person is having some pimples or acne, so wherever that person is going, there should be a less of confidence in that, in its personality to face the world, to face the society. But when we are talking about cosmetics, so when we are applying different kind of different variety of cosmetics and those cosmetics will help to prevent all those kind of acne, pimples and any kind of infection on the body, then it will help to in, uh, enhance the confidence and psycho it will give a positive psychological effect. Cosmetics are not only related to a different kind of a lipsticks or polish nail polishes or nail enamels or eye and face makeups foundations all the kind of ointments which are there for skin that is also coming in a category of cosmetic products and cosmetics has gained popularity in the last three four decades and its use has been increased exponentially both in males and females because we cannot say like that cosmetic products are only used by a female segment or a female section both males and females both are inclined towards cosmetic products the range only is different according to the requirements and their physical appearance but cosmetic products has been used by both sections males and females and we can say for the child section also variety of cosmetic products are available in market the most popular cosmetics are hair dyes powders and creams some of the example of cosmetics are skincare creams, powders, lotions, lipsticks, nail polishes, eye and face makeup, deodorants or anti saprins we can say, baby products, hair colorants, sprays, etc. These all are coming in a category of a cosmetic products. Uses. When we are talking about cosmetic products, what are their actual uses? First, the major uh, use of any cosmetic product for the cleansing purpose. They're used as a cleansing purpose, moisturizing and beautifying agent. They help in enhancing attractiveness of the body. 
they also help in altering the appearance of the body without affecting its function whatever the makeup we are wearing and applying on our face so it will change the appearance of that some uh, facial uh, features it will help to change or enhance the beauty so in that not a single inside function of the body will be affected sunscreen products also help in protecting the body from uv rays and treating sunburns acne wrinkles dark circles under eyes and other skin imperfections are treated or repaired by treatment products cosmetic also help in treating skin infections variety and a number of skin infections due to different kind of allergies are uh, there so those are also can be treated easily by the variety of cosmetic products which are said to be the medicated cosmetic products and they are they can be used on the basis or the prescriptions of doctors only classification cosmetics has been classified into four types those are the broad category of the cosmetics one is said to be skin cosmetic hair cosmetic nail cosmetic cosmetic for hygiene purpose skin cosmetics in which we can see that all kind of skin care products which are coming just like moisturizers night creams cold creams vanishing creams other kind of ointments and hair cosmetics comprising of hair colors uh, different kind of hair oils hair sprays which are coming in hair cosmetics nail cosmetics comprising of nail enamels nail paints nail polishes those are and cosmetic for hygiene purpose uh, comprising of soaps shampoos body washes hand washes sanitizers all so that's why this is the reason that cosmetics has been categorized into four major types and those are coming in this category types of skin care products which are available skin types general skin care routines face cosmetics lip cosmetics and hair cosmetics and the classification of cosmetics depending on the physical form so depending on the physical form cosmetics can also be classified just like emulsions in which we can see an example of emulsions in a form of cold creams and vanishing creams powders face powders talcum powders tooth powders sticks lipsticks deodorant sticks because these days in market uh, in uh, apart from the deodorant sprays which are available deodorant sticks are also available which will help to protect uh, maximum amount of sweating by protecting our skin with a layer of that particular deodorant spray or a stick oils hair oils hair tonics which are available jellies hair jellies paste toothpaste deodorant paste soap or like shampoos shaving soaps solutions after shave solutions which males are usually using and aerosols which after shave spray so these are the particular classification of a cosmetics in which we are uh, using from night to morning all kind of a cosmetic products which are available and every one will use according to the requirements but the proper knowledge of a cosmetic is very important to understand that what kind of uh, our skin is there and what kind of a uh, products which we should apply on our skin then only the work of that cosmetic and the effect will be getting in a positive mode so i am concluding this video today and in our next video we will talk about the kind of uh, skins or the types of uh, skins on for which different kind of cosmetic products are available in market so we will have a proper knowledge in that bye for now